yellows and all the all the chilies. Okay. Okay, another one is that's why we're asking American ones again to join up our work is by combining California work. He used I mean he made tons of things to fight for the rights of people, but all of those things he did is like no violent, he never used violent against anyone. He been in jail for several times because of people fighting and of course um that contractors they don't want they don't want him to fight because they're gonna end up losing money because they have to pay for that right. Okay. It is also an entire generation of German Americans who measured political and sociality in the nineteen sixties and seventies. Millions of people who were cutting grapes and other products become a social accepted pattern of behavior. In both quotes from his page, we find that very well stated his credibility. We we gave great statistics. Okay, as we read and analyzed the, the speech, we all agreed that it was the best speech for instead of Chavez. It gave a feeling of a conversation, but how was he was talking, given the speech, the people felt that he was talking to them, not like for a whole speech. Every single people thing was talking to them. Okay. Um, Pilar Chavez was not the final, definitely not all straight fried. He was not shy. Yvette says that she now has a better understanding of how hard it is to work out in a crowd field under the hot sun. She also now understands how her parents and grandparents, aunts and uncles all fell back when they had to do this labor. Okay, um, I used to work in the fields for two summers. It was really, really bad. Because you get a little pay and you suddenly have to be out there working at the sun or like really high temperature, 120, one, one sorry. And really bad. So you start sweating and sweating and then you get really tired. And then when you get a check, just like a little amount of money. You don't see like those little checks. If you get your degree, your bachelor's degree, or things like that. They're like minimum wage. You can do nothing with that. Today we have looked at one of Susie Chavez's speeches. First, we discussed the significance of the speech. Second, we looked at how Cesar Chavez used ethos, logos, and pathos throughout his speech. And third, we share what we learned from his unique speech. We would like to end our speech with the closing statement that Cesar Chavez used when he ended his, and it reads, Today, the day will come when the politicians do the right thing by our people out of political necessity, and not, by, um, not, and not out of charity or idealism. The day may not come this year, the day may not come during this decade, but it will come someday. And when that day comes, we shall see the fulfillment of that passage from the book of Matthew in the New Testament. The last shall be first, and the first shall be last. And on that day, our nation shall fulfill its creed, and the fulfillment shall, and the fulfillment shall enrich, us, enrich us all. And in the words of Cesar Chavez, don't forget, see si se puede. Sí.